Hey guys, this is Eric Miller. I'm at M&M 2023, and we're here in the mega booth talking with Austin from High Rocks. So tell us, Austin, what is it that High Rocks does? Yes, High Rocks, we are a uh, seller of digital microscopes, uh, along with white light confocal chromatic uh, sensors. And uh, we work with a bunch of different companies. So we work with the semiconductor industry, PCB, uh, manufacturing, automotive, uh, textile, uh, cosmetic, uh, you name it, it's there. So tell us about your main your main product, uh, which is there at your booth. It's a it's a highly automated uh, a light microscope. So tell tell us about that. Yep. Our microscope is a fully motorized X, Y, and Z um, with a one micron resolution uh, on on the Z axis there, and then with our confocal chromatic sensor, we can go down to the nano level resolution. As far as zoom ranges go, we operate from zero to about 7,000 X. What sort of features does the software yes. have? Yeah, so uh, in terms of our software, it is on the Windows 10 and 11 platform. Mm -hmm. I know a lot of folks are kind of more of a, in a closed system, some of our competitors, where it's kind of an all-in-one unit. Mm -hmm. However, we decided to make our system more modular. And for, for doing so, you're able to provide your own computer, you're able to load on any software on that computer, you're able to connect that to the network. We're able to use Excel to give you that one-click kind of data reporting functions. Um, that's after making your 2D, 3D measurements, any annotations, um, video recordings, anything like that. Um, additionally, if anything goes wrong, it's typically going to be on the computer side. Say a hardware goes bad or hard drive goes bad, uh, monitor breaks, something like that. And you simply just replace that um, instead of having to replace the microscope system. Mm -hmm. And then additionally, computer technology typically ages a little bit faster than microscope technology. So that, that can last... Um, microscope wise 20 years the lenses and everything are all going to be the same it's great glass and then the computer maybe I don't know four or six years nowadays who knows so you got anything else that's interesting other than your cool motorized micro microscope so we, we do offer our nano point scanner it's what it's called it pairs seamlessly with our optical microscope and that gives you uh, nano level profilometry um, and so what we can do is on the optical side with microscope we find the area we're looking to measure, and then we'll delta shift over to the chromatic confocal sensor. And then from that, we can able to get our nano level measurements, um, and it will provide just like an incredible detail. Um, it's one of the only, I think we're the only company that does this, especially at this resolution. Um, and yeah, it's, it's been really great so far. It's made by our, our Europe side, and um, they've been using it for all sorts of applications, um, especially in museums. We've been able to work with a ton of really cool museums, working with um, really famous painting, Picasso, Vermeer, wow. all these things. And we're essentially doing complete 3D scans of these paintings. And, and in order to capture and recreate uh, for restoration purposes, for um, uh, his historical purposes, uh, it's been it's been really nice. Wow. Yeah. Working. That's pretty fascinating. Thanks a lot, Austin from <laughs> Austin from High Rocks. So, <laughs> we'll see you guys on the next one. We've got more to come. Thanks.